Hi friends, uh, this is Hari Krishnan, and this particular video is about uh, collecting soft copy of uh, written assignments from students. The reason for doing so is uh, we may ask the students to submit uh, word documents, okay, uh, word document of uh, whatever assignment we are giving. But the problem is uh, they'll just copy it from multiple sources and uh, without reading they'll upload it, okay. At least when when they are writing, they'll see certain words and uh, statements. Okay, so that's the thing, and we want them to write and upload it to our assignment section. Okay, and uh, uh, I'm going to create this as a sequence of three videos uh, to demonstrate uh, first one creating the assignment from teacher's end, and the second one assignment upload by students, and third one validating the assignment by teacher. And this is the first part of the video and here I am going to show how the assignment is created from teacher sent with proper instructions. Okay, we will continue. Right, uh, for those who are uh, uh, following me from my first video, you might know that I am using this class, okay, second BCAA on which is on top. And uh, as a quick recap, I will just uh, tell you that I am using two IDs okay this particular ID is acting as a teacher and uh, here I am going to just demonstrate the faculty end now so I am getting inside the class okay so I have logged in this class as a teacher so I am going to classwork section uh, for your uh, information I have already created the assignment content over uh, the note section so I'm, I'm not going to type anything new. I'm going to just copy it from here. Okay, right. So, uh, as we already know, we have the option to create assignments here. So, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to click plus symbol here and uh, I'm going to select assignment. And here it is asking me to provide the title. So, I've already uh, prepared that one in notes. So, I'm going to the notes section and uh, this is my question. I'll read it for you after copying. Right. So this particular thing is all about uh, testing. So WT in the sense I'm giving a written assignment, right? So they're going to write. I need some sort of a marking to understand uh, what sort of an assignment it is. <laughs> okay. So for that I'm keeping an identifier WT, written form of uh, test or written assignment something, right? So this is the first assignment I'm giving and the question is submit a handwritten copy of the following question. Write four test cases for find dialog box. This is the question and I'm giving you a description. Uh, the test case should have the following things, right? So all those all such things I've given and then in the description column, it is must to add uh, how they are going to submit it. Okay. The students will... Uh, they will not be very comfortable with whatever things you, whatever instruction you are giving, okay. But still it is our work to give clear instructions to them, how they are going to upload it, okay. Uh, so, here are the steps to complete the assignment. I am going to copy and paste all such things in. Yeah. In the description column. So, I am pasting it. So, the student, what the student must do to complete this assignment okay so here they are going to write the assignment in a sheet and they are going to open the classroom application and uh, the assignment wt1 and uh, they are going to attach it by taking a photograph okay they are going to click the attachment link and they have to choose take photo option and they will be taking a photograph of it and uh, they will be pressing hand in or turn in whichever button comes there in the assignment space and they have to submit it that's it okay and I'm going to fix the points as uh, 10 here and the due date for the assignment at present uh, we are at 30 March 30 the current date is uh, March 30 and uh, the time is uh, by the time I'm uh, speaking the time is 11:49, and uh, I want this assignment to be submitted before 4 p.m. today yeah that's it right 4 p.m. today right so they have to just prepare uh, their assignment in a sheet and 
uh, I have to add another instruction uh, since it is a college assignment. Don't forget to write your register number on top of your sheet. So this is something uh, we need actually. <laughs> okay, so I've given the instructions uh, to them. And uh, another option is there, even you can schedule this assignment, okay, when you want to release this assignment to the students. If you want to keep it as, uh, keep it like a test, okay, you don't, you want to give them uh, two hours time, okay. So if that is the case, we have given the due date, due date and time as uh, today 4 p.m., right. If I release this assignment by 2 p.m., we are giving two hours time. So if you want to schedule it, you can schedule it, right. You can select uh, March 30 and select the time as uh, 2 p.m., okay, 2 p.m. Don't forget to select the a.m. and p.m. option and press OK. That means the test will be or the assignment will be available to them. This whatever thing I have prepared will be displayed only at 2 p.m. and the students have they have to submit it before 4 p.m. Okay. So this will sometimes be considered as open book examination or open book test. Okay. The student will be given all the options to copy it from multiple places but somehow they have to find the answer and submit. Okay. At present, I am not going to use this option. Okay. Once you press the schedule button, uh, automatically the schedule will be confirmed. But I am not going to use this. I am going to use, I am going to send it. That's it. So, my assignment is ready now. Okay. So, I have asked them to submit an assignment. Okay. So, assigned to only one student, Hari Krishnan. And he has not yet submitted it. Okay. This is the current status. Fine. And this, uh, with this, uh, the first part of this uh, video clip is over. And uh, if you want to know how students will be submitting the assignment, uh, please check the info column or else uh, you may just browse my videos to find it out. Thank you.